answer? Okay, we talk about percent. So, what is percent? Percent, it is a relative value indicating hundred parts of any quantity. Okay, class, how can we solve percentage? Anyone? Alright! In solving for percentage, we should determine the total amount of what you want to find the percentage. And then, divide the number to determine the percentage. And lastly, multiply the value by 100. We have here our example. The amount of rain during the month of April, 30 days. Let, let's say that it rained 15 of the 30 days in April. You would divide 15 by 30, which equals to 0 0.5. Then, multiply 0 0.5 by 100. This equals 50, which would give the answer of 50%. So, in April, it rained 50% of the time. Very good! So, give yourself a round of applause because you remember all of the things that I did discuss to you. Right now, we're going to discover a new lesson. Are you still with me, everyone? Alright! So, we will going to talk about Ratio What is ratio? Ratio, it is a term that is used to compare two or more numbers. And also, it is used to indicate how big or small a quantity is when compared together. The formula of ratio is A ratio B equals A over B. We have here our example 1. A backyard pond has 12 sunfish and 30 rainbow shiners. Write the ratio of sunfish to rainbow shiners in simplest form. So write the ratio as a fraction. So we have here 12 over 30. Now reduce the fraction. 2 over 5. So the ratio of sunfish to rainbow shiner is 2 ratio to 5. Note that the ratio of rainbow shiners to sunfish is the reciprocal 5 over 2 or 5 ratio 2. Always remember that read words problems carefully to check whether the ratio you're being asked for is a fraction of the total or the ratio of one part to another part. For our activity, find the ratio, decimal, fraction, and percent. So there are four to answer. I will give you 10 second, seconds to answer this activity. Do you understand? 
all right so right now let's leave our classroom peacefully and have a good day everyone goodbye